Hi, I'm Joey Gabarda, Classic Honda Midland. What's been going on month to month? Business is very well. Oil sustained a very uh, aggressive price and we have been very fortunate over the last few months because we've worked our allocation very strong. So we have a very decent supply of inventory, which it is starting to run lean a little bit. The industry always comes back. You know, the car business is very cyclical. However, since, you know, 2017, uh, you know, the, the trends on, on the cycle have been very inconsistent. But the car business is always going to be there. There will always be a way to distribute cars to the public. Uh, what's great right now is the customers can kind of get what they want, but unfortunately, a lot of them have to wait for a little bit. You know, with supplies being the way they are, a lot of these vehicles inbound are pre-sold, which is a competitive advantage for any dealership because, you know, once the cars get here, if they're automatically sold, they're not paying a whole lot of floor plan interest on these cars. So the great thing for the customer right now, you know, trade-ins are worth all the money. I've seen pre-owned vehicles, some more than what a brand new car costs uh, because it's the basics of economics. You know, it's supply and demand, and supply right now uh, on new cars and pre-owned vehicles, very, very low, which brings demand very, very high. And where the customer can benefit for that, if you know, if you have a two, three, four, five, ten-year-old car, it's worth a lot of money right now. And we've been buying a lot of cars off the street. A lot of dealerships are buying cars off the street. And a lot of the, the customers are taking the money and running, and, and it's a good investment for them right now. You know, we're midway through 2021, a little bit past that. But, um, you know, going to Q3 and 4, uh, you know, we're, we're going to track a record year, and hopefully uh, it can continue into 2022.